ACC double team. Finds Purvis, finds Vital, finds the inside of the rim for three. And they'll get another chance. Gray to Dotson. Got it for three. Huskies run. Robinson, well-established position, and Purvis ran right smack into him, and Purvis is down on the floor. You see him, he's coming up, and look, he tries to avoid him. It looks like Robinson just kind of turned a little bit here. I'm not sure this was a good, yeah, it was a pretty good call. He did establish himself, he, he stayed strong. 10 to shoot. Davis, got it. One of the underrated things about Houston is their defense and tonight. It's feisty, Earl. Rob uh, Gray with the spin around. And certainly that's deserved, but Kelvin Sampson's defensive schemes are special. From outside, and the scoreless drought is broken. Ten to shoot. Gray pulls up for three. Here's Gray again. Right hand floater. Well, that was an issue last night. And Brima with the put down. Well, UConn's going to have to do some special things to get Purvis open because Houston is ready to defend, but they're not ready to defend Vance Jackson. He's ready early tonight. Last night, he's already made a three from deep, but here on the closeout, they're standing straight up at Jackson. He didn't do this early in the season. He was basically a standstill shooter, but there you see the elevation. The freshman Vital for three. But they don't get a tight trap. See, Knowles has his hands down, which allows Spacey to pitch the ball back out, and they do a great job. They have the floor space, and they move the ball before Houston can rotate. Colley with the patient slam. Jackson with the spinner. Inside to Colley, stripped away. Adams anticipated the inbound pass. Purvis, and one. Great recognition of the strip as Colley puts the ball down on the floor and then the push ahead. And this is reminiscent of last night, the attack from the wing by Rodney Purvis with the finish in transition and the foul. Gray. Got it! That's a two. Been coaching a long time, and one thing I know is that he watched that tape last night. Adams takes the long bounce. The Huskies run. That's a bad shot by Robinson. Purvis. <laughs> Purvis had a little bit of a siesta in the locker room just to kind of get his wits back after he got floored and got hit in the shoulder, but. First on the defensive end, he's locking down Damian Dodson. Purvis on Devin Davis. High glass! Devin Davis backed up, and the length of Davis gets up. Okay, getting there, but just bump not being strong enough with the basketball, and here comes Adams. Here's Spacey. Robinson guards him, tries to feed it into Vital. The low pass fielded by the freshman, and he banks it in. Adams had the ball stripped on the way up. Gray on the run out. And a standing ovation from the Cougar bench on that one. Early. Houston trying to crawl back with the slam from Rob Gray. Dotson. Over Jackson. Meets the double team, comes back the other way. Finds Purvis for three. Great job of just finding the open man. Damian Dotson gets kind of turned in and Purvis gets him on in the corner. From outside, Adams got a three. Grimer with the block. Purvis the step back. Gray swatted away by Grimer. It'll stay with the Cougars with nine to shoot. Robinson, the long three, bails the Cougars out. 
Adams to Purvis. Bravo with the putback. Aiming his description. Dotson might have caught um, a sensitive area. Robinson drives over the top of the leaping Hamida Brahma. Adams. Five to shoot. Natal lets it fly. Too strong. Rebound right to Facey. He goes right in. He would have pitched it back out, but now he is feeling more confident as an offensive player and just turns, takes his time. Robinson has three. Meyer has three for Houston. Gray has three points. A real good look by Devin Davis. He Adams for three. Adams spins. Outside to Jackson. Got it for three. And the exclamation point on the night. And Purvis, the senior, taken out of the game. And a chance to get great appreciation from this crowd. Houston's NCAA tournament dream will be halted in Hartford by the Yukon Huskies, whose quarterfinal tournament magic happens again.